Still staring at this thing with this evil twist. <sighs> Look at that. It's a half an inch. I, how the hell this happened, I don't know. Um, but I'm not liking this. I, I want to rethink this. Um, I looked up the specs on these glides and um, cut to the chase. They're more self-supporting than I thought. And so a couple things. Number one is I think I might be overbuilding the, the actual rails going across. Um, it's just a lot of metal. Um, and it's a lot of metal to keep straight. Also, because of the nature of this box tube, it's slightly uh, pregnant, <laughs> curved, it's bulgy, and um, so it's difficult to get a, um, a solid reed across these guys to make these guys perfectly flat across. Um, in hindsight, I think I would have done a lot more of this frame out of uh, angle iron instead of box tube. I maybe should have thought of that um, during the steel ordering. But I'm thinking that I'm actually going to go from this huge concoction of stacked up box tube to flat stock. Um, that three inch wide flat stock that I got. Um, it's it's going to be far more rigid this way. Like it's not going to, you know, the weight is here and it's going to want to bow in the middle. I mean, it's going to want to sag that way. And so, A, I'm going from two and a half inches of meat to three inches of meat. It's roughly the same strength because this is two layers of 16th inch. Whereas that'll be one layer of eighth inch, so masa manus. Um, and then just put a strong back behind it of maybe some one inch stock. And then in terms of the rigidity this way, get that out of the glides. Just let the glides kind of support themselves with, uh, like I said, just a little bit of help with a strong back like this on edge welded to the flat stock. And I think that I can get that flat stock um, more easily square, more easily flush, and I don't think I'm going to have any of these little David Bowie issues with this material. Um, I don't know. I, I, you're probably going to see six videos tonight of me staring at this, trying to figure out why the hell this happened. Um, no good. All right. Um, this is a moment to stop and regroup and rethink our design a bit, I believe. And, yeah. Alright, um, dang.